Hello everybody. Sorry for all the glares, but um, I am finally back on. I don't know what my problem is. I just got lazy. Um, I did do a little cleaning because I'm getting rid of a lot of crap in this house. Well, somewhat I can. I guess we got to keep going. Um, but we also had a mishap. Well, it's not a mishap. I think everybody deals with it. We had ants. Every time we turn around, we see an ant. Oh my god. I can't wait till winter. And it's too hot. It is hot in Illinois. Illinois right now, they're saying it's 82. It feels like 120 to me. Oh, plus, I'm running around the house. Um, so, I'm sorry I haven't been on for a while. I really am. Uh, the last thing I showed you guys is what I got from the Wish app. I know I got more coming in. Like I think three more items coming in from the Wish app. Uh, I gotta wait till next month to start ordering the rest of the stuff on my list. And there's some stuff I was deleting, you know, that I didn't really care, did, don't really need. But I'm gonna still try to find more. Now, next month is my birthday. It's the end of the month, so everybody don't worry. It's the end of the month, so yeah. But anyways, when I came on here to show you, I'm sorry this video is so late. Um, I'm already, I'm already in three nail polishes in to my new set, but I have my new set of nails. Um, I'm going to show you what I wore before I got these done, and it's been like a week. So let's get down to it. Um, let's see if I can start with this one. I got to flip these all right side up. Um, this, I wonder if anybody has any plans for Memorial Day, I think it's Memorial Day. I might get the freaking holidays wrong, whatever this weekend's supposed to be. But this first one is called Split Pea Soup. Now. Let me get one of the thing, because I gotta tell you a story about this one. Hold on. Um, where is it? Where is it? Is it? Right here? Nope, that's not it. Uh, is this one it? Yes. Okay, I asked my son sometime last month, pick out some polish, a polish that you want me to wear. Because I got bored of me picking them out and everything else. Well, he picked out these two. If you guys remember on my Snapchat and my, uh, Facebook page, these are the two I wore. And this one is called, I forgot which hand I wore it on, but this one's called Split Pea Soup. And this is very pretty. It's very, very pretty. Two coats, I think it was two coats. Two coats be fully opaque, I'm gonna go with. Okay. Then on my other hand, he wanted me to wear was Ring the Bellini, if I say this right. This is from Sinful Colors. This was a three coater all day. I think it was a jelly, but it was hard. It was so hard to get off, but I like it. So that is what he had me wearing. Okay, let's see the next one. This is probably the last one I wore. I wanted something, I don't know. I honestly don't know what the heck I wanted, but this is what I had. My nails is kind of way off, grown, grown way out. But this is OPI. Live Love Carnival. I really love this. This is like a one to two coat. And my subscriber, Vicki Thornton, gave this to me. Hi, Vicki. I mean, I really do love it. Um, okay, next one. I was so happy that one of my subscribers gave this to me. Stupid me, I kind of think I forgot. I think I won this one from Jessica. Polish Queen. I haven't watched any YouTubers in like maybe two months. I haven't watched anybody. I just been so bored of watching shit on TV. I I'm back in watching uh, Prison Break again. Um, I just I don't feel like watching YouTube. Maybe I'll start doing that like at the end of the night, start watching it because I gotta catch up on what's going on out there. I don't even know what the heck's out there. All I know is the OPI Washington DC collection, which I saw some polishes there. I want some of those. I really truly do. I hope maybe Friday, maybe Sally's has got some. Or I might go to Ulta and do it because I can gain more points. I have to gain more points to get, um, what's it called? Uh, I forgot the name of it. Prime, I think, to get to the next level. And I got, I want to do it by the end of this month. So I got to go in there and start spending stuff. So maybe I'll just go to Ulta and spend some, you know, get some stuff from there, from the, you know, collection. And I am ordering the China Glaze, uh, the rest of the fall collection. I will order that this month promise you that will be ordered but this is cabana boy and i really loved it this was two to three coats i've always wanted this really did i got some news i gotta tell you guys too let me get this done first okay the next one is okay 
I went to, I'm gonna tell you the story about this one. I went to Sally's in the beginning of the month, okay? And they had some polishes out. I think it was their neon collection they had out. Well, I picked up one, okay? I wasn't really infatuated with it because it looks like all the same colors to me. Yes, I'm colorblind, but to me, it looks like all the same colors that I've already owned, stuff like that. And then one of them I bought at Sally's, the other one I bought at Walmart, which I actually got shocked. I'm gonna show you. This one I bought at Sally's. This is Tell Me About It. Towel, like you were towel to get out of the shower. Tell Me About It. This was three coats to be fully opaque, but it's gorgeous. I'm actually glad I picked this one up. It is gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Now, but underneath Tell Me About It, I found, which I've heard everybody rave about it, and I actually do like it, and which I might wear this one next just on its own, it's Alpine Snow. I honestly am so happy that I have Alpine Snow, and everybody's right about it. It is a little bit of better white. Two coats, no streaking, it is a little better white. But I still want the Color Club French Tip, I think it's called. I still want that. I'm going to order that this month. I'm going to do that. But this is it. Two coats with fluo peg. This is Alpine Snow, which I'm glad I got this. Got this at Walmart. That's where I picked that up at. Okay, Harley, you're gonna have to wait because I'm making a video. Okay, this next one I picked out, and this was really beautiful. I got this one from, was it Rini? I think Rini gave me this one. Renee, Rini, I'm sorry. <laughs> I like calling her Rini because it sounds a little different to me than Renee. So I hope you understand that, Rini. <laughs> but this is a Mermaid Dream, and this was very beautiful. But yes, it was kind of hard to take off, but. Too Close Be Fully All Peg is from Deborah Lipman. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous polish. Now I'm going to put this back up my top. There we go. Oop, top thing here. Okay, next one I have is Combat. This is from China Glaze, and I like this. I love this. This is from the Fall Collection. Oh my god, this thing is, you know, two coats. It's all it needed, and it dries matte, and I left it matte. I mean, it's beautiful. It's called Combat Blues. Look at this baby. It is gorgeous. Sorry about the lighting. It is gorgeous. It has a shimmer inside of it, so it's very, very good. But look at that. You can't really tell the shimmer on the nail unless you have a light hit it. Okay. I put this over here. The next one I wore. Okay, these two is another story for this one. I didn't know which one I wanted to decide. I wanted to wear both of them, so I wore one on one hand and one on the other again. So this one is, oh wait, no, not this one. Hold on, wait, wrong one, wrong one, wrong one. These two, sorry, these two. This one here is called Orange Punch. I wore this one from Orly. Beautiful neon, and don't need, this one does not need a base white coat. It does not, okay? I'm letting you know that now. This does not need a base white coat. This is beautiful on its own. And. No, it doesn't. I thought it may have a little shimmer. It didn't. Okay, uh, the next one is Fireball. Fireball does have a little bit of shimmer in it. It's gorgeous. I don't know if you can see it right here. Yeah, my lighting's bad. But this is Fireball. Let me get the swatch out for you. This um, looks like I put a white on the bottom of it, on the back, but I used it without no white that I can remember. I don't know. I forgot if I used white underneath it. I think I wore it plain. But this was two coats be fully opaque. It was gorgeous, though. Gorgeous. Okay, last two of the pack. Um, this one is Disco Dress. This is drop it. from Color Club. This is very beautiful. I love this. I can't hold on to this. Very beautiful from Color Club. I mean, I love it. It's a very beautiful disco dress. I'm just putting my polishes there right here up there. Last one is from Essie. This one I am so, this is the last one I wore. The last polish I wore for my nails, I wore for two weeks. Um, and I just got, I, I'm like, I don't feel like doing no more. My nails are like crap. I'm not gonna make a video with my nails, that's why. So, um, this is Jamaica Me Crazy, but this is a must have. Everybody should go out and find this guy and polish. This thing is gorgeous. I'm in so much in love with this. I wish I could find more polishes like this. With the this, this shimmer inside of it, I mean, it was just like, ba-bam, is what it was. I mean, it was beautiful. I loved it. Three coats. Okay, well, that is all the polishes for what I wore. 
um, last month. So, yeah. But, um, what I do want to tell you guys while I'm sitting here talking, I'm going to put my stuff back. What is this? Sinful colors. Now I gotta go find my sinful colors. <laughs> I want to just put some of this stuff back so I have everything back on the shelf except for whatever I had. Whatever I have already out. But what I'm wearing on my nails is called. Hold on, I'm getting my magnifier right here. Galato on my mind which I was thinking about these pot, this polish here. I really was, I was thinking about it. Before that I had something else, I had, um, what, what do you want to call it? Um, I forgot the name of it. Butter London. And yes, I wore $15, $15 polish. But I loved it. It was gorgeous, it really was. Now what's this one? Is this OPI or is this Love in the Cards? Yeah, it's OPI. Um, but yeah, so my news I want to tell you guys about, first I want to tell you something. If you guys see right here, this thing right here, don't worry about this stuff, this is fire pit burning stuff, I just have it here. But this thing here, that used to be my, um, so-called pantry. Like, I will say the last couple of months, my husband and I and my mom went to, um, food pantries the last couple of times. I hear like a beeping noise. Like someone's alarm went off. It's not mine. Oh well. Anyways, so what happened was is that we've been going to food pantries and everything else. Oh my god, we got so much stuff. They kept giving us rice. Oh, this upside down. They kept giving us rice, beans, and stuff like that. And you know, it does help out a little bit. It really does. We got spaghetti up the yin yang, you know. I mean, it does help. I mean, I'm not gonna complain about it. I mean, it does. But, so what I did was, last month I went through all my stuff. I, you know, put it in the cabinets because we had ants. And I go on my shelf, we had this big bottle of Skippy peanut butter. And, um, combat blue. That's weird, someone's alarm's going off. <laughs> nothing's going on about it um but I go buy it because I was like can I find something to snack on and I'm sorry that alarm's irritating me and um there's ants crawling all over so I was like okay I looked inside I opened it up I killed the ants that were on the outside I looked inside if there was any inside there's none inside Cleaned it up really good. I think maybe like some of the peanut butter like came out of the container when I opened it. So I think it was my fault. But I cleaned it up and now it's fine. Okay, that's done. Um, what are these two? I know one of them is Zoya. Oh, here's quarterly. I'm just trying to put some of this stuff away so I don't have to really do it while I'm talking to you guys. Oh, and another good news. Well, my, okay. Last weekend was my nephew's birthday. Okay, we went to his house for a fire. We had a blast. I don't even remember stuff. He was telling me we were burning cushions. We were burning um, everything we could possible, buckets. I was like, I don't remember that. The last thing I remember, and I told him the last thing I remember, which I'm not putting on YouTube. Um, disco dress, you're making me crazy. Hold on, I'm trying to make sure I have it. Okay, that goes in extra. This goes in extra. Skipping stones. That goes in wet and wild. Okay. Which I got wet and wild right over here. <laughs> so, other words. Uh, anyways. So, we were ha we had fun. He had so much fun. You know, I was glad that he did. Leaf me. Popping culture. I'm trying to find what is. Oh, this is wet and wild. Harley, I'm on videotape. You can go lay down somewhere. Now my dog wants to go outside. I'm doing something else go outside. You guys all know that. How long is this video? Oh, 14 minutes. Good. I got a little bit longer to talk. So anyways, I go over there. And the house that he purchased before was... Um, oh my god, I showed you guys the wrong polish for 
this one. Oh, no, 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 no. I showed you the wrong one. I am so sorry. Hold on. I'm going to try to find the right one here. Here it is. I can't believe I did that. Hold on. Let me get these off. Get these back on here. Hold on, I'm here back. Okay, I'm back. I had to let my dog out and try to fight with these swatch sticks. Okay, but anyways, so I go over by his house and um, his house that he purchased was, he bought it from the park, not the park, the owner that owned it before. Well, she left a lot of shit in there, like couches. I mean, it smelled like cat piss and their dog piss. Well, he got that all cleaned up, plus the smell. So I go in there, I'm like, I go, um, I just smell like pee, cat pee in here again. He goes, look in the other room. I go in there, there's kittens in there. I'm like, oh, so cute. Well, the first batch he had was, uh, let me show you this polish real quick. This is split pea soup. This was two coats to be fully opaque. One to two. That's split pea soup. Sorry, I had the wrong swatch. Okay, back on with the story. So I go in there, I'm looking around, I'm like, oh my god, I want I want another cat. I've always wanted another Russian blue, but you know what, they're going to be so hard to find, I'm like, why don't I try to get one? Well, I was telling my husband about it, he's like, no, 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 we don't need no more animals, da, 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 da. I'm like, what the hell is one cat going to do? I lived in the house, had four cats and one dog. What's wrong with that? We were still able to feed them, you know? But anyways, so, I might sound, it might sound wrong, I got two cats, you guys all know that, and I got one dog. But you know what? I do want another kitty. So I go over there and my, my son came home Sunday. I walked over there by my nephew's house. After I did a little bit of walking around I was playing Pokemon Go, my son and I were. <laughs> went and saw the house. I mean, saw the kittens. Joseph picked out one. Well, there were three black cats and I think a couple, bunch of tiger cats. I really didn't want a tiger cat. I don't want a tiger cat because... I've dealt with the tiger cats. My stepdad has one. That cat also used to always attack my holly. And I get mad at it. You know, I would. I get mad. I spray it with water for, you know, a punishment. I'll put it in his cage for a punishment. You know, I didn't do it at the same time. But, like, not nah, soak it. I, like, that and run off. You know. Um, but that's all I did. And I just didn't like it. I told Joe, so I really don't want a tiger cat. He picked out one. Doesn't even remember which one he picked out. He forgot, right? So then my nephew tells me, he goes, I'm picking up another, you know, litter tomorrow. I'm like, for real? He goes, yeah, there's a couple of gray ones in there. And I'm thinking, oh my God, Russian blue, all day. I was so happy if it's a gray or an orange looking cat, I want it, you know. I go in there, they are white and orange, white and dark orange, you know. And we saw the mother, the, they have the mother. The mother was cute. Again, the mother does not want nothing to do with the kittens. And they're only five months old. So... Which that's a good thing, you know, because I can, you know, bring them. They're already potty trained for five months. They're already potty trained. That's the awesome part. <laughs> so we picked out. I we picked out two. I wanted one that was real light. I wish I could show you guys the pictures somehow. I don't know how on earth I could show you, um, because of course I can't edit shit here. Um, I got another update to tell you. And the other one my son picked was a darker gray with white, and it had a little beard right here, and it's a girl. Mine was a boy. And I kind of want a boy because I like how the boys act. Blackhawk Psycho, he's fun. You know, he's Psycho. Holly, she just, well, she's old too. But I love Holly. You know, don't get me wrong, I love Holly. But the one he picked, I think we're going to go for that one. The one with the little beard. Gonna, that one's, uh, that one right there, we're probably going to take. And then they have this other cat. She's almost all white. She's got black hair and black and white, like on her tail. That cat is gorgeous. But, no. So, anyways, um, and I think about getting, you know, he gets a kitten. I'm going to have him change the cat's litter box, feed the cat. He's seven now, he can do it, right? What does everybody else think? I mean, I'm going to help him out, you know, but what does everybody else think? Don't you think a seven-year-old should learn how to take care of an animal? Because he never really took care of Harley. I mean, he feeds Harley, he gives Harley a treat, you know. But I, he's never really seen how, he has seen it with Blackhawk, how we take care of the cat right away and stuff like that. So, anyways, um, and I told my son, I go, if you behave in school, I guess what time it is. Okay. 
If you behave in school all this week, at the, Friday you will end up getting that kitten. That's why I told him Friday, which it might be Saturday because Friday I'm doing a lot of running around. We have to do a lot of running around with the sun, everything else. So he might get it Saturday. But um, I do want to take it into the vet. So I think I'm going to make an appointment. I gotta tell, I'm going to tell my husband when Thursday comes around, I'm going to make an appointment at the animal hospital right here. Or I'm going to call around and find out somewhere cheaper. And uh, get her checked up. I'm going to try to see if I can get the cats uh, their shots. So I'm sorry I rambled on. I just let, had to let everybody know what's going on. Because I know everybody was like wondering what happened to you. Are you alive? Or, you know, um, I know some of you guys know I am. But other ones really that much don't. Um, I haven't really been putting up any pictures of on face on, you know, I don't even think I took a picture of my nails with the Jamaican, Jamaican be crazy. I really don't think I did, but I've been putting, I have like three polishes I got to put up on Snapchat, Facebook, and my love for polish group. So if you guys are new here, add me there. Facebook, I have to add you friendly, but you will add me at it automatically because I'll go on and add. Um... Hit, hit me up on Instagram and follow my, my uh, Love for Polish group. You guys can put, ask me questions up there. You guys can put your own, you know, manicures up there. Do it, you know, just put it right up there, okay? Well, I'm going to let everybody go because I have to go pick my son from the bus stop. I will see you guys later. Bye!